Hello boys and girls, right now I have what I believe to be an Israeli Model 4, which is the older brother to the Model 4 A1 and the middle child to the Draga Simplex. Okay, so it all started with the Draga Simplex, which looks the same as this mask, except this piece was the other way around and it was sometimes gray. Um, and they're kind of rare. And from what I've seen on the internet, the Israelis made the Model 4 in the 60s to 70s, and then sometime after that, they made the Model 4 A1, which is like the same mask, but it has like a little um, valve here, but it's for a drinking tube and the filter intake is a little different. Always uh, on the regular masks, this part is down here and this part is up here, but on mine it just it came like this. I'll explain later. Okay, so my mask is what I believe to be a model 4 and not the improved um 4A1. And I got this at a gun show for $45. And it came with what might be the original filters, but it came with like this German style, um, what is it called? Zivelschutz filter 68. It came with this one screwed into the mask and it still has the plug on it. Then it came with this one, which has the plug in the bottom and the plug in the top. And it even had this which proved that it was like a freshly sealed, well not freshly sealed, but a sealed filter and it hadn't been opened. I had ripped this off so I could open the filter. But from what I think is the date, this one was made in 1970, so I have no plans of breathing through that soon. And this one was made in like maybe, maybe 1969? I'm not certain. That might just be some random number. Um, but the filters are in like decent condition. There's some little scrapes on them. They look cool, especially in the mask. Yeah. Um, and from there's like these markings on it, like. That one, which from the photos I've seen of Israeli Model 4s, I believe this is also on the Model 4s. So I think that's what makes you believe it's a Model 4. It's a size medium, I think, and it fits me. But it doesn't pressurize, but that's because there's usually a band around here, like a silver tightening band, and there'd sometimes be like a screw on the bottom, you like screw it open to, or screw it closed to tighten the mask. At least on like most masks that borrow the Draga sort of like valve, exhale, intake valve system thing, they have a little band that holds on to the rubber part of the mask, and mine was missing that. So I have like a zip tie going around it. Otherwise, um, if you get it close enough, it'll start to seal and make like a pressurized fit, but it'll let air go through. And it has, I think, a one, two, three, five point harness system. And it has these little pull tabs, and you lift that up, and you pull this through, and it goes through pretty easily. But this mask is like a, you have to like, adjust it to your size every time you put it on and this mask is probably really old so I don't really want to be like stretching the rubber because I just got it so I have those like first time like I don't know the limitations of it so I don't want to mess with it feels when you first buy something but um it has It has a little oral nasal cup, 
which was upside down when I first looked at it, but then I fixed it, and it's kind of been like sitting in a bag folded, so it's kind of like naturally just stuck together, so you have to pry it open and then put your face in it. Um, it looks pretty cool. And it was, it's in pretty good condition for being as old as it might be. And the rubber is, like, pretty good. I'm pretty sure there's no, um, like, cracks in the rubber around the eyepieces. And in the eyepieces, you can see, like, the little band that holds them to the rubber. And the screw that's used to tighten it. But I can't show you that because that would be an awkward mess. And of course, this piece would be upside down on a regular mask. But when I bought it, it was already upside down. And it just, it fits better upside down. So, I'll just leave it on upside down. I don't know if that affects how it works. But, I don't know, the mask doesn't really work as it is. But it came with this filter, and this one, and it also came with this bag. Which at first glance, I thought it was like a, a British light anti-gas respirator bag, but I might be wrong. I'm pretty sure I am. I don't really know what bag this is, but it has like this little pocket in the front, and this button is like it doesn't want to move down, so I'm not gonna force it. It's pretty old, and on the inside, it has like this little divider piece that goes, it like folds down, and then at the very bottom there's like a piece of metal you can see that gray piece right there it's like a piece of metal riveted riveted into the bag and there's this like ancient twine tied up I don't know what it's there for but this part of the bag is really handy for putting a filter in putting the divider over it and then putting another filter in and then there's this part of the bag which has no dividers and you can just put the mask in there the guy that I bought it from threw it in there, or he threw the bag in there, he was like, you want me to package this thing up, and then he dug it out of an old tote, and I got the bag thrown in for free, and I'd say that's a pretty decent deal, you get the, some weird bag, two filters, one sealed, but I'm probably not gonna breathe through it, unless, like, you have to because it was sealed so it might still work but I don't know I'd rather not and the mask in good condition I'd say that was a pretty good deal but right now it doesn't really work so I'll have to find the proper part or somehow jerry-rig it because the zip tie doesn't work so I might have to get like a, a hose clamp or something that'll work because the zip tie is actually two zip ties zip tied together I don't think it provides enough tension on the it doesn't like squeeze the rubber and the I think plastic filter intake assembly oh yeah this is in 40 millimeter NATO so no like 40 millimeter ghost. I'm pretty sure it's in 40 millimeter needle. Because it's. Like the simplex is in 40 millimeter needle. I don't know, I haven't tried it with a ghost filter. But yeah, um, so I'll probably have more videos on it when it's fixed. But until then, um. I don't know.